Hello and welcome to Be Your Own Exterminator, the do-it-yourself series where we take homeowners like you through a step-by-step -step process on how to get rid of unwanted pests. Today, we're here with Ron, and Ron's got bed bugs. Lucky me. Don't worry, Ron, by the time we're done here, we'll get rid of them all for you. All right, good, the sooner the better. Now, just a question. What made you want to take on a project like this all by yourself? Well, I've always been a bit of a do-it-myself-er. You know, um, if I could fix anything around the house without hiring anyone, you know, it gives me that sense of accomplishment, but I also save a lot of money. And plus, I've used Hot Shot products before. They never let me down. Great. So let's get started. And the first thing I need to stress is, and this goes for any treatment options, make sure that you follow all of the instructions. Today, we're going to be talking about three different products that kill bed bugs and how and when to use them. They are the Hot Shot Bed Bug and Flea Fogger for entire areas, the Hot Shot Bed Bug and Flea Killer Aerosol Spray, and the Ready to Use Liquid Spray. Let's start with the Bed Bug and Flea Fogger. Now, this can can be used to treat a larger area so that the bed bugs, they have no place to hide. Any bed bug or flea, for that matter, that comes in contact with the fog or any treated surface are killed by contact. So how many foggers do you think I need? One fogger would treat up to 2,000 cubic feet. That's a room that's approximately 15 by 16 with an 8-foot ceiling. Okay. But don't use more than one fogger in a room, and if you're treating an area that's smaller than 5 by 5, just open the door and let the fog from another area come in. Gotcha. Now can we set this fogger off and kill these things already? <laughs> soon, soon. Right. First we need to prep the area. Uh, does that mean like we move everything that's not nailed down? No, not oh. exactly. Okay. What it means is you need to remove any and all pets, close the windows and doors, and turn off any fans and air conditioners. Now if there's any dishes or utensils or food, make sure that's covered up. When it comes to clothes, you need to put them in sealable bags, wash them in hot water, and then put them in the dryer for at least 20 minutes. Uh, what about like uh, the rugs and the, the furniture? When it comes to rugs, window treatments, and upholstered furniture, you're going to want to leave them in place. Okay. Okay? Open the doors on any cabinets or interior closets that need to be treated. And now, the spray's not going to hurt them, but if you have any waxed wood floors or furniture in the area, mm -hmm. you're probably going to want to cover them with some newspaper just to prevent any marring. Oh, okay. And take note, because this product contains a flammable ingredient, be sure you turn off all ignition sources, such as pilot lights, shut off gas valves, other open flames, or running electrical appliances that cycle on and off, such as refrigerators and thermostats. As for the actual fogger activation, it's a pretty simple process. One, shake the fogger well before use. Okay. Hold it at arm's length, point it away from your face and eyes, and press down on the pad until it locks in place to start the fogging action. Two. Place the can upright on a table, stand, or box, no more than 30 inches high. If you're using a table, make sure you put down some newspaper to prevent any surface buildup. And then you leave. Wow, that sounds simple enough. But now is leaving an actual step? Because I would make three steps. <laughs> Regardless, just make sure you don't re-enter the treated area for at least two hours. Ready? Yeah, sure. After two hours, open the doors and windows, turn on your fans and air conditioners, and allow the treated area to air out for another 30 minutes before reoccupying. Use a vacuum to clean up any dead insects. If you have one, attach a crevice tool to get to the tricky areas. And be sure to empty and remove that vacuum bag from your home. Come on. Hey, so when would you use these other sprays? The 17.5 ounce Hot Shot Aerosol Spray Canister and the 32 ounce Ready to Use Liquid Spray Bottle are really spot treatments. They're ideal for targeting specific areas. So like my luggage after I return from a trip? Yes, you can use the aerosol for that or use either one if you just want to treat your bed and select locations. Both kill on contact, they're non-staining, and they leave behind no oily residue or film. It is always a good idea to make sure that you test it in an inconspicuous area first. Now the only thing left to do is to show you how to use them. <sighs> to use the aerosol spray canister, shake well before use. Hold the container in an upright position with the nozzle pointed away from your body. Depress the valve and spray at a distance of 8 to 10 inches. Okay. Spray each square foot for about 5 seconds or until damp. Die, bed button, die. <laughs> oh, help me, help me. <laughs> just a joke. That's just a joke. To use the liquid spray bottle. Shake well before use. 
hold the container in an upright position, set the nozzle to wet spray, and spray the infested surfaces until thoroughly wet. A couple of things you need to keep in mind. You gotta vacate the area after treatment and ventilate before you reoccupy. Do not allow children or pets to come in contact with any treated surface until it's completely dry. And when you're treating your bedding, make sure you clean and air out both your mattresses and your box springs and allow them to dry completely before using or replacing your bedding. How does it feel to be bed bug free? Well, I feel like a new man. You know, I just saved a lot of money by doing this himself. And just so you know, Hotshot brand also has travel size bed bug and flea spray it's for when you're on the go. This is gonna make sure that you don't get bed bugs again. That's all we have for today. I hope we were able to answer any concerns that you had about self-solving your bed bug issues. And congratulations on becoming your own exterminator with Hotshot brand products. <laughs>